Hello friends, this is Amit from Smartify. First of all, thank you for trusting Smartify products and keep supporting us. Since 2016, we have been developing Made in India products for your home automation needs and keep introducing new products from time to time. You can check about our other products on our YouTube channel also. Today, we are in front of you to introduce our new NoteSwitch series products for you. Before proceeding, let's try to understand how the setup of switches is there in our traditional homes. Firstly, there are metal boxes which are fitted to the wall, generally at the time of construction itself. These metal boxes are of a standard sizes. Then there are electrical wires which come to these metal boxes, live, neutral and earth. On top of them, there are modular switch plates which do fit to these metal boxes. Now, these plates are of standard sizes from 2 module to 18 module. On top of these switch plates, modular switches do get fitted. Okay. Or you have non modular switches like this, which you have screws at the top and bottom, which are fitted to PVC box, sorry, PVC sheets. Okay, once this is done and if you have to make your home as a smart, let's see what are the possibilities. First thing is like you can have your smart appliance like smart LED or smart fan and then control those appliances with their respective apps. Second is you can change this normal switch plate with a smart switch plate like uh, this one is of a Smartify smart switch plate with which you can control not only light fan but any other appliances also like uh, mosquito repellent, induction cooktop, water cooler, gardening solution, anything. Now there is a third approach also where you can continue using your old switch plate and still make the home as a smart. What happens the note switch series products goes behind that fit to the same metal box and you will be continue using the same switches and also make the home as a smart. Now this is convenient for people who are living in rental accommodation as they do not have to make any changes to the switch plate and make, still make their home as a smart. When they relocate, they can simply take out the smart modules along with them and move to a different place. Okay. Now let's see what set series of products we are having as of today. So today we are launching four models in our Loadship series. First one is a four pulled output product which we call NS41. Second is five pulled output product which is we call NS51. Third one is eight pulled output product which we call NS81. And this is four pulled output plus one fan output. So fan output means like you can control the fan, also control the fan speed also schedule the fan speed to level 1, 2, 3, 4. So it provides 4 level speed to your fan. When you purchase the product, it comes in a standard packing box. Like all Spotify products, each there is a unique serial number and activation code at the back of the module and also at the back of the uh, product. When you open the packaging box, there is a wiring diagram, user guide, and module. User guide provides you all the basic details used for Wi-Fi configuration, installation and technical specification and also the contact number for the technical support. Wiring diagram is a very important document. Though the wiring is very simple and we will try to showcase everything possible into the, this video. We will also show you a live demo but still you need to follow this wiring diagram. In case of doubt, you can always call back to us and we will assist you. Okay. I will briefly explain the basic uh, content of all the common modules. So as you can see, there are AC points at the below where it is live, neutral and output points P1, P2, P3, P4 up to P8 depending upon the models. Then there are DC points at the top where common is there which goes through to common all the switches 
and S1, S2, S3, S4 will go to the individual switches. If I can show you. So, live and neutral will go the AC point. P1, P2, P3 will go to the load like fan or light point. Between module and the switch plate, there is a common wire which goes to the COM port and individual switches will go to S1, S2, S3, S4. Okay. Once this is done, all wiring is done, you can check the connections by normally operating your switches. So you should be able to operate all your lights as you were doing before after the connection also. Now once it's done, you can proceed for Wi-Fi configuration. People who are familiar with the Smartify product know that before going for Wi-Fi configuration, you have to take the product to setting mode. Like in previous model, the first switch was setting mode switch. If you have to long press for 5 seconds, the device goes into the setting mode. In this, you have to toggle the switch on off for minimum 5 number of time to take the device to setting mode. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. So this device will go to setting mode after that. Now how to judge whether the device is in setting mode or not? You need to go to your mobile Wi-Fi setting. You will be able to find a new 12 digit number which is same as the serial number of the product there. If you are able to see the 12 digit number there, it means the device is in setting mode and now you can proceed to Wi-Fi configuration. In subsequent section, we will show the wiring diagrams to you. Thank you. Okay, now let's see how the wiring connection is being done. On the end point, we have put the neutral wire. On the L point, we have put the live or phase wire. If you can see, this is live. On the P1 point, we have connected to a load. In this case, which is an LED bulb. So these are the AC connection, live, neutral and output. Now these are DC points which are connected bridge between the smart module and your switch plate. So there is a com. So a common wire is going across all the switches. For S1 point, we have connected, with, connected to the first switch. So in the same manner, you can connect the other switches also like S2, S3, S4 to other switches also. So if you switch on your first switch, the light will go on. Okay. This is your standard operation which was done, which was happening before the switch also. Now to take the device to setting mode for Wi-Fi configuration, you have to switch on off the first switch for minimum 5 number of times. Now the device would have gone to setting mode by now. If you go to your mobile settings Wi-Fi, you will find a new 12 digit number there. In this case, this is an NF41, so you will find a number with NF411 something. Okay, so now device is now in setting mode. You can proceed for Wi-Fi configuration. So please see the other video for how to do the Wi-Fi configuration for Smartify switches.